Cheap Joe's is the same price on this type of paint, which this paint's from France and it's really nice. But what happens after you've used this paint for a while, this is the student type, you realize they use too much um, linseed oil. And so you end up wanting to buy white from Hobby Lobby because this is from Michaels, but it's also from everywhere because everyone sells this. Um, but I feel like everyone's real competitor is Michaels, um, everyone on the internet. So Cheap Joe's still makes money, but really Cheap Joe's is getting undercut by, by Dick Blick. But then hopefully I'm thinking that Dick Blick has paint that's more similar to this than this because this you like because it add because there's the extra linseed oil, but then you think, wow, I'd rather add linseed oil myself if I want that much linseed oil in there. And that's why I, do, I don't have any of this white paint. Um, but what I've learned is that they also have artist grade paint that, but I feel like they purposely make their white paint super creamy so that people buy the artist grade white paint. And that's why I'm hoping that if I got paint from Dick Blick, that they got to the point that they're at because they're good because they make their own paint, right? They, they're a paint company also. So, um, whereas Joe's is, was a catalog company and I, I don't know if they make their own paint and that's the real problem that Joe's has. Um, is like they're getting undercut because the other people make their own paint. And so I'm hoping that I'm gonna go to the paint people and they're gonna give me paint that's not as cr creamy, even though I love that this is creamy, I like that it's easy to apply, um, but I do kind of wanna be, be able to control the creaminess. All right, so um, all I'm saying is Dick Blick, yeah, they sure wanna send you a Dick Blick. Uh, oh no, they don't. They, they wanna show you that they will, in fact, on their coupon page, which by the way, I'm very um, loaded up with their coupons now. I mean, dude, they are gonna be cheap after the deal I just got. And, Cause I already got a deal. And then I got a deal on top of that. I'm like, dude, I just got that big of a deal. That's crazy. Uh, but it's because they supply their own paint. But their paints are still dependent on, like these people I, I have to go to and I, I am very, but I feel like on their artist grade paint, they're not going to be as creamy, but they, it's like they specifically try to make their student grade less good. It's like, you don't, I, I mean, I understand making certain things less good, like having like Viridian hue instead of Viridian, but, um, do you really want to make the consistency less good for students? You would think you'd want to make it the same because if they're a student, don't they want to learn? Um, but I guess you're selling linseed oil is cheaper, but I don't think that it is. Um, maybe it is. I don't know. All I'm saying is I feel like there's a reason certain people get ahead, but um, at the same time, I feel like it's tough for small businesses. And if there's any time right now that's difficult for small businesses, it's right now um, because of the coronavirus. But um, these people are making a lot of money and these people are out of paint. And Hobby Lobby doesn't even have this paint anymore. I mean, it's crazy. Um, Actually, it's not crazy. It makes sense, and you think it's really not that important to have paint, but um, it is to some people, I guess.